between the climate and biodiversity crisis, the way we meet and communicate the natural world we know is changing. Human creativity, the increase in technological capacity, accessibility and connectivity have a lower proliferation of content platforms and conception of digital visual media which allow our society to be hyper-informed. Even though much of the news spread is not true. Warning on deforestation. The last decade was the warmest on record. Scientific data on global warming and its origin have with little difference at least three consequences that affect the generation and spread of pandemics. The deterioration of habitat, ecosystem and extinction of animal and plant species, the melting of glaciers and permanent frost, the highly pollution of the atmosphere. World population, the number of inhabitants is increasing in all countries and the world population threatening to increase in the coming decades to 80 or 10 billions. The world faces two energy problems. Most of our energy production skill producing greenhouse gas emissions and hundreds of millions lack access to energy altogether. The energy issue that received the most attention is the link between energy access and greenhouse gas emission. Bats, bats, bites, their saliva, one particular eating fruit, and hunting bats for food are all potential ways to get infection. However, bats do not seem to harbor more virus than other animals. Claims on diseases caused by bats are often based on ill-founded speculation. And what about the digital technology? In the context of current globalization, not industrial, commercial or service policy, as well as social policy, will be successful it is if it does not address the need to incorporate the principles of sustainable development as good for economic growth. It is no longer possible to take advantage of natural resources and produce it to the maximum without considering the environment impact general. Greenhouse gas emissions from a small farm have these numbers. Pay attention, 80% production, uh, 76% customer use, 3% transportation and 1% recycle. Internet traffic in our daily lives not many things may happen in a minute. But when measuring the deep of internet activity that school at once, it can be extraordinary. One minute of internet. Amazon customers spend $280,000 uh, uh, 12 million people send an image. Six million people buy online. YouTube user stream 690,000 videos. Facebook like receives 44 million visits. Instagram users share 65,000 photos. TikTok user watch. Uh, 167 million of video and um, faced with this argument the key issues of the society of the present that will inscribe the future as human beings as academics as 
global citizen, we should pay attention to three things. The metaverse, artificial intelligence, and the blockchains. Technological leader, led by Mark Zuckerberg, seek to create a parallel and virtual world where we can be who we really want to be and without physical barrier to try it and kind of experience. As uh, that uh, blockchain is a database uh, store information electronic in a digital format. Bitcoins, in the span of the years, the amount of energy consumed by Bitcoins, meaning it's about the same as in a lot Sweden. But in like Sweden, where almost half of the energy produced comes from renewable source. If Bitcoin were a country, it would be among the top 30 energy users worldwide. Hyperconsumption. Faced with the un uncertain and threatening futures, precarious employment, fragility of human ties, the society of hyperconsumption offers vital goods momentary moments of tranquility and happiness. Lipovetsky speak of paradoxical happiness. Fast foods, McDonaldization, McShove, McJam, McLevel are all common guarantees to describe the low ways, precarious slick marketing and poor food cultural imperialism and the force of economic homogenization that McDonald represents. The practice of transnational corporations affect the health of the population through their production methods shaping the social determinant of health. Public service media and public service internet. It's a manifesto that has ten principles in its introduction. They are democracy and digital democracy, we call public service, media, and we call safe warning, the extension of public service media, call for an internet that improves democracy, we call public service media to become public service platform in internet that help promote opportunities and equality in society. Climate change. It is necessary to create a stable and healthy world where resources are shared equally. The local effect of climate change is more relevant at an individual level. They impact more people than the general phenomenon of global warming, especially when the direct effects are combined with the news broadcasts in the media. The conscience stresses the body reaction to the demands of the war, stresses or events or condition in your uh, environment that can trigger stress. Today we are witnessing a generation that perceives uncertainty scarred by the futures. The warnings of the scientific community have been ignored in the last 50 years to take real actions while war governments looks the other ways.